Plumbing problems can be tough. Here I was installing a valve and just two days later, look at this thing, it's split into two parts and this sprayed water all over my house. But unfortunately I still need to use this well and I can't get a replacement valve like this on a Sunday. So I've got to connect these two sections of pipe and here I'm going to show you an easy way to do it. Start by removing the leftover bits of the valve. Now that's a short area to connect, but I'm going to use this flexible piece of stainless steel tubing. But the good news is this thing only cost about $13 and you can get these at any hardware store because they're normally used for connecting up hot water heaters. But for this repair, this is going to save the day because even though it's way longer than the section I need, I can just bend it around and kind of pigtail it and make it fit right into the space. And now in just a few minutes, I've got my well water back online. Everybody in the house is happy and I've got plenty of time to figure out what I need to do to get a replacement valve. Now, you're not really going to want to leave this in place even though this pipe is rated for full water pressure and these pipes are ideal for permanent connections to water heaters, water softeners or any type of filtration equipment. 